All right, we have some stories to keep on your radar as we kick off a brand new week. We start with the United Nations recognizing today as the International Day of Education. It is meant to acknowledge the role of teachers in our society and the work that they do in shaping our students' futures. This is the fourth International Day of Education. This year's theme, Changing Course, Transforming Education. The UN says it is hoping that the day will create a dialogue about the fundamental right to education. On Thursday, the Bangor Bureau of Motor Vehicles will be closed temporarily. Staff is moving equipment over to its new location, which will be on Griffin Road. Officials say the new location has more space, more parking. The office will be closed on Friday as well. The new location will open next Monday. Also on Thursday, the main CDC joining several organizations all across the state to host a virtual forum on emotional well-being during the pandemic. The forum is free. It will feature a number of different speakers, including Maine CDC Director Dr. Nirav Shah. This starts at 6 o'clock, and you can register online through the Maine Community Action Partnership. And Friday will mark 36 years since the Challenger explosion. New Hampshire teacher Krista McAuliffe, part of the seven-member crew that after she won a national competition to get on the shuttle, it exploded 73 seconds after launching. It killed everybody on board. In response to the tragedy, NASA did not send astronauts into space for more than two years as it redesigned a number of the features of the space shuttle. For more on any of those stories or more, you can visit the New Center Main website, or of course, you can always check out our mobile app.